Hey everyone, time for a little history on the road. This weekend I'm in Vermont at the Hildeen Estate, which is in Manchester, Vermont. It's an estate built by Robert Lincoln, son of Abraham Lincoln. And one of the featured items, because Robert Lincoln was a railroad man, is a Pullman car from 1903. I've been dying to get into one of these things since I'm writing a book, as many of you know, on the Pullman strike of 1894. So let's go inside and check it out. George Pullman was one of the great entrepreneurs of the 19th century. He realized in the 1850s that rail travel was becoming a thing and that rail travel really was terrible. It was uncomfortable, it was dirty, it was smelly. And so he set out to create luxury palace cars that were a little more expensive than regular trail travel, so still within the reach of the average person, but they provided sort of this opulent uh, travel experience. Pullman created cars that offered passengers a smooth and quiet ride, plus opulent surroundings. This one features Cuban mahogany, embroidered upholstery, and Tiffany windows. His genius move was to create seating that converted to beds for overnight travel. These upper cabinets convert to bunks. Here's what a berth looks like when it's been converted to bedding. So Pullman, you know, really filled a need out there and uh, became a very, very wealthy man as a, as a consequence. This Pullman car was built in 1903 and uh, it was been beautifully restored by the people here at Hildeen. Uh, they bought it in 2009, restored it and brought it here in 2011. And it's a real amazing place to an amazing piece of history to walk on through and to see what it was like to travel in style in the late 19th and early 20th century. There's a lot more to the George Pullman story, including his model town, the great strike of 1894, and the plight of the African-American porters he hired. But that's for another day and my book, which comes out in 2024. All right, that's going to do it for this episode of History on the Road. If you enjoyed it, click like and don't forget to hit follow to keep up on all things history. Thanks.